what's up y'all so if you made it this far um i've already <clears throat> i've already prepped my face i moisturize my face and i use these two primers to prime my skin i use this for my t my t-zone this is the baby skin maybelline primer and if you guys see me looking over here i'm looking at my vanity mirror y'all and i use the elf i'm almost out but i got an extra because i don't even play that but y'all this is the baby skin instant pore eraser i used it in my t-zone under my eyes so yeah my face is already set i let my primer set in and let's get into it so you guys i always start off with my brows y'all should already know this nothing changed um so uh, let's get into it like let's really get into it and talk about it y'all i almost feel like this year um i almost feel like i'm still in like this is like my last month of 2023 like i don't know it just feels different like it's i don't want to say it's weird i just know it's a shift i don't know what's going on but i just feel like it's a shift in the universe because i actually really don't feel like my year actually really started off yet if that's making any sense y'all like i feel like you know i did my cleansing i did my reset i did all of that extra you know but i just feel like on a spiritual level, let me say that. On a spiritual level, I just feel like, you know, like, I just feel, you know, I don't, I don't know, I don't know how to put it, but yeah, y'all, um, I've set my goals. Did, I ain't do no vision board. I've never, like, y'all, I've never done a vision board. If you have done a vision board, comment down below and, um, let me know how, let me know how that is, how that is for you like is that something you know that i mean for some people it's necessary because somebody some people are like visionaries and stuff like that like that's an easy way to manifest and stuff but to each his own i just never felt the urge or never felt the the need to do a vision board because i'm a writer i like to strip script so like journaling and stuff so i'm into that type of stuff so i just be writing and I've did all of that. I released and remove people, places, and things that no longer serve me. Like, let's get into that. Let's really talk about that. Like, letting go, y'all. Letting go out with the old, in with the new. Like, I'm lightly going in with my brows with this um, NK Makeup Eyeliner Pencil in the color black, y'all. Lightly, lightly, like heavy on a lightly because I don't want my brows too dark. And I'm just really just, as you can see, just filling in the middle because I really want to go with, go, I don't want no really, you know what I'm saying, dramatic brow. I just going to use this like this, like fill in my ends, like, like that, like so. And then just, you know, brush the product through my brows. But like, that's what I was saying, you guys. Like, yeah, um, I've did my reset. I've released, I removed. I, you know, took a breather. I've been meditating a lot, y'all. I've been really like, you know, getting back to myself slowly. And I love that for me because I'm always on the go. Like, I'm always time, 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 like, keep like going at a fast pace like i'm about to you know i'm out of time and stuff but i'm really not i'm not going nowhere life's not going nowhere it's always going to be here like my goals my my goals my accomplishments my dreams and all of that stuff that i'm trying to get to it's not going nowhere like i just have to slow it down y'all slow it down for real like girl you know slow and steady wins the race you know what I'm saying? And I feel like it's very important to get out of that rat race mindset where everybody, because everybody has dreams. Everybody's trying to make it. Everybody's trying to get to the top. And it's like, we're going to get there, but we're going to get there in our own time, in our own space, because God knows, like God knows what he's doing. God is always on time and you will know when it's from God and you will know like when it's not, because when it comes fast and easy, baby, and it's right at your door. It's like, you know, you might want to, but you know what I'm saying? When it's from God, there's no confusion. When it's from God, like everything is just, 
planned out well like everything is done like to the t the t's are crossed the i's are dotted type you know what i'm saying so that's where i'm at but besides that y'all i'm not gonna do too much with my brows i just needed to add a little color and fill them, fill them in a little bit so comment down below if y'all if you guys have done y'all reset have you guys done y'all resolutions and y'all goals and planned out everything that y'all want to accomplish and do for this year like comment down below if y'all already 10 steps ahead <laughs> because i i'm getting there and i'm glad i'm getting there at my own pace i'm getting there at my own speed my own timing like that's exactly like all that I'm worried about and that's all that matters to be honest to me right about now but y'all yeah that's why I'm at with it and y'all I felt like I haven't done this in so long like I felt like I haven't really been you know what I'm saying talking to y'all I haven't really did my makeup since Christmas I have been sat in front of the camera and talked to y'all and I think what a few months like for real like for real for real like I haven't been, I just feel like I haven't done this in so long. And it's like, I'm relearning and getting back into the groove. I'm getting back into the swing of things. Like I haven't done this in so long and it just feels like crazy. I just, I just feel like, you know what I'm saying? But we're going to keep the vibes and we're going to go with the flow. It's our year. Like it's odd to me. Like, I don't know about y'all. I'm keep speaking for everybody. Let me speak for me. For me personally, I feel like this is my year. I feel like... I'm about to take off. I feel like God, I have so much stuff. God has so much stuff planned and lined up for me in my life, for my life. This year, I'm going to receive the fruits of my labor. Like, I'm going to grow. I'm going to expand. I feel like I'm going to bring everything from my mind, my visions into reality this year. Like, I'm stepping out of my comfort zone, y'all. And I'm really, like, fit to get to it. Like, I ain't even fit to flush. Like, that's how I feel. Because, you know, God always bring... God always tests you before he bless you. And I've been tested so much. Like, I just be... You know what I'm saying? But I'm, I just, you know, keep moving forward. I keep going through it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I keep moving forward. I keep excelling. I keep prevailing. I keep persevering throughout life y'all and it's it don't matter what it is work love life money career whatever it doesn't even matter like what it be i just make sure i be like okay what's for me is for me if that's not for me then it ain't meant you know what i'm saying man's rejection is god's protection baby always remember that um i'm gonna go in with something new y'all i was gonna set my eyelids but i don't think i am because i'm just gonna keep it like plain now i'm gonna set my eyelids let me stop cap stop the cap let me stop the cap so i'm gonna go in with my laura mercy a translucent um setting powder and dab a little here and just set it and just and i'm just taking everything slow like i'm really not in a rush i'm really not trying to like <sighs> when is my time coming and keep dwelling on that i'm just really just going with the flow y'all and really just taking my time with being the woman and creating the woman that i want to be y'all like really putting my mind to it and really getting in a groove and really like manifesting really like where i want to go where i want to be how i want to look how i want to dress and stuff like that like i'm really like I'm right there with it. I'm at that stuff. Let's get into it. Um, I got this LA Nude. This is so cute, y'all. This looks so cute. And this is traditional LA Colors Nude Eyeshadow Palette. This is something essential. Um, I got a Morphe Jacqueline um, Volume Palette, too. And it's, like, full of bright colors. It's this. It's this. It's this right here. Like, with a lot of colors, I got this thinking that, like, I was going to really, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not really into all of them colors. Like, I'm not really into the color thing. Like, that's not where my mood at. That's not where I'm at in life right now. Like, I'm really not, like, I'm really not, that's not where I'm at right now in life. These look like shimmers. I'm not even going to lie. I'm not even going to hold you. So, they, like, very glittery and stuff. These are like shimmers, so I think I'm gonna go in with my NYX palette for the brown. Like my NYX Ultimate, go in with my regular, regular, go to Schmegala. 
and go in with the brown. Don't talk about my palette. My kids was playing in my makeup. But I'm going to go in with this brown right here for my transition shade, y'all. And just put that up there. So since I got my transition shade in, y'all, I'm going to go in with the palette now. On my lid, I'm going to do one of these bright colors. So I think I don't know, I think I'm gonna go on with this color right here, this new shade, and just place it on my lid. I'm just, we're gonna like y'all. I'm going with the flow. I'm just, let's test it. Let's let's test it. Yeah, it's cute. It's subtle. I like it. And y'all went in with this color right here, just in case y'all don't see it. That color right there. I'm just gonna smoke it out on the end. I'm going in. With, I'm still with my um my NYX Ultimate Edit with this dark color over here and just use this at the end just to smoke it out a, a little bit just, all right y'all so now for my foundation y'all know i'm going with my 368 deep golden maybelline fit me poreless foundation y'all beauty caviar as you can see contour blend it out i'm about to go in and blend out my concealer with my concealer brush real technique real technique 210 um expert concealer brush <laughs> for my nose. Okay, y'all, so now that I got everything blended out to my liking, I am going to apply some blush. I'm gonna go in and apply some blush. And y'all, this came from Sheen. I love this. This is um Swipe Right from Sheen, y'all. From She Glam from Sheen. And I love this color. Like, as soon as I got this, I was like, hell yeah. And I'm a blush girl. I love blush. If y'all haven't noticed. I love it. I love it. I love it. So I'm going in with my blush brush. Ooh. From Real Techniques. And just blending that girly in. And y'all, look at it. Like, look. Look. You know? Especially for my skin tone. Like, it's not doing too much. It's not a bright pink. Like, 
it's just enough it's just enough baby it's just enough it's just enough you know but yeah y'all like that's where i'm at with it i started this year off now we're moving on to relationship i started this year off single of course you guys so no i am not in a relationship no i ain't looking for nobody and no i don't want you not putting y'all in my business but i'm not really with the vibes i'm not even really into um i'm not into the to the games to this to this generation dealing with this generation's men because like they make you wanna you know what I'm saying and I'm not no mm -mm, baby no uh uh I'm not with that like I am for sure like I don't want to say I'm giving up on love and I'm over it but like listen if it comes it comes I have faith you know what I'm saying? I have faith that I'm going to meet the person of my dream and meet my significant other. But until then, baby, everybody else, baby, they can kick rocks for all I care. Like, on some real, real, real stuff. Like, I don't got time for games. I ain't got time for none of that. I'm focused on myself. I'm focused on my path, my career. I'm focusing on me. And if you're not adding value, you guys, if no one brings value to what you already got going on in life, to your heart, mind, body, and soul, to your finances, to your career, I don't care. Let them go. Release and remove them. Like, all that holding on just because of bond, holding on because of soul ties and all this stuff, baby, get rid of them. Because at the end of the day, like, their happiness is more important than you. I didn't think so. You know what I'm saying? We got to learn how to, you know, put ourselves first and focus on what we really want. And just because you want better for yourself, you have standards, you have values, you have morals. Do not mean. Do not mean. Don't ever let nobody make you feel like you bougie or you doing too much or you think you all that just because you want more for yourself. Like, don't ever let nobody play you down like that, okay? Don't let nobody play you down like that, baby. Like, no not at all no ma'am no ham no turkey not at all like so on a love and a relationship part y'all like i'm not really into it i'm not looking for nothing i don't want i ain't gonna say i don't want nothing because i do but i'm not looking for nothing i'm not looking for nothing y'all like if it comes it comes because god himself knows what I need and what I want, I manifested and I gave it to God, and that's what it is, and that's what it's gonna be. Okay, let that baggage go. Okay, like I need y'all to so listen. Like, let that baggage go, honey, because you know what I'm saying. One man's trash is another man's treasure. We gotta uplift ourselves. We gotta love ourselves. We gotta be in love and happy within ourselves in order to love somebody else. Anyways, we gotta get ourselves together as women. We have to put ourselves first, love on ourselves first, be obsessed with ourselves first in order for any man, any woman, your child, your mother, your sister, your brother to love and be obsessed and show you so much gratitude and love. Like you have to have that already set for yourself that and if you don't have that, that is a big red flag, y'all. Like, that is a big red flag. And you gotta go within, work on yourself. Yeah, I'm just blending out everything before I said it. Cause I'm that type of girl. I gotta make sure everything is blended. Make sure everything is blended before I said it. I don't want to do no harsh set because you see it's already like a cute. It's everything coming together. So I'm going to go in with my infallible 550 bronzer to set my contour. Not too much going on. Okay. Not too much. And just set that. Set that. And everywhere I contour, I'm going to it with the bronzer because like i said it's like a real like a little subtle look you know a little one two not too much going on and make sure this is blended out after i'm done with this brush i'm gonna go back in with my beauty blender and make sure like you know what i'm saying everything is blended out so if it look harsh 
because it look good right here you know in front of my venue but if it look harsh on camera y'all i'm gonna make sure everything get blended out the right way okay okay can't forget the nose i think i'm gonna go in my um black radiance palette to come to go over my nose to make it darker because i like a divine a defined um um contour for my nose like i like it to be like really defined I mean, the bronzer is doing something, of course. Don't get me wrong. The bronzer is, you know, doing what it got to do. But I just think I need a little bit of, you know what I'm saying, a little oomph. And if you've been here on my channel, you know I like to outline my nose. Like, I don't like to create a nose job. I don't like to create nothing new. I like to enhance what God already gave to me. So I'm going to go in with, where is it? I'm going to go in with this brush, like I said. I'm thinking, yeah, I'm going to go in with my True Complexion um, Dark to Deep Black Radiance. And as you guys know, I hit pen. I'm, I'm, I'm digging up scraps, y'all. I'm digging for sh scraps. You understand? Know like, like, I love this. I love this. I need to get annoying and I need to stop playing around. And I just outline my nose. If y'all know me. Y'all would know, like, uh, I like to enhance my features. Like, that's why I love makeup because I don't do it to be on some transformation type. You know what I'm saying? Like, I like to enhance what God already gave to me. So I like to, you know what I'm saying, enhance my features and go a little darker on the nose. It's going to make such a big difference, y'all can see. Just bring that up into my brow. Wow, ta-da, and ta -da. Like, yes, this is what I live for. This is what I love, this is what I like. And like I said, I'm gonna go in with my, um, my beauty blender. And I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender. And just, bam, baby, bam. So I'm gonna go under my eyes, I'm gonna set my eyes. I haven't used my powder puff in so long, y'all, because when I first used it, I wasn't really into it because I didn't really know what I was doing, I wanna say. I knew what I was doing, but I just didn't see the... So I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna try it. And I'm going to, I crease a lot under my um eyes. So I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender before I set and really like, as you can see, all the like i be creasing like hell so soon as i get it together i have to immediately set like i have to immediately and just like that and just go over Go over everything else with the leftover powder, y'all. Not too much. Just to set it. Like, I'm not to OD. So, I'm just really going in with what's left over and just set everything. Alrighty, you guys. So, for blush, I'm going to go in with this CoverGirl Cheekers. Um, This was my favorite. This is in the color Rockin' Rose. Rockin' in Rose. And I love this color. And I'm going to use this to set my blush i haven't used it in like a year because i've been um glued and stuck on to that um skin glaze y'all that skin glaze is bomb but i'm just you know what i'm saying i haven't did use this in a year and i love how it's so effective you know all right set that blush okay Put a little on my nose. Period. So I know I'm looking ashy right now, y'all, but don't do too much. I'm gonna go back to my eyes. I'm gonna do eyeliner and my lashes. But before I do that, let me sweep away this white cast. 
So yeah, y'all, how have the New Year's been treating y'all like? I was gonna go in with my NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop um, pressed powder in the color Rich, but this is actually too dark and I don't like what it be giving. So to take away this ashiness, I just used the Sculpt Sculptor from my Black Radiance palette. And I used this Soft Accent brush from Real Technique. And I just go over I go over the little demarcation in the line, y'all. What I do every time to get like that cast look. Cause everything gonna melt and you know what I'm saying, come together once I set everything. Before I spray set my face, y'all, I got all the powders on and everything. I'm gonna go on with the NYX Dewy Setting Spray, as you can see. And I'm gonna set my face. Set my face. Let this melt. Alrighty, you guys. So here's the finished look. I went and did my makeup. My put on my lashes and my liner. And this is the finished look. I got Fenty on the lips. I got hot chocolate and fussy with um the black um lip liner. That's all with some clear lip gloss on top. Got the Mac um gold deposit um on a you know what I'm saying on a highlight. Got my hoop earrings. I did my hair, you guys. And um yeah. This is the finished look. Um, if you made it this far, I appreciate it. I thank you so much. Follow me on all my social media platforms and subscribe to my channel. Leave a like and a comment down below and share. Stay tuned for more videos and let me know how y'all like how the look came out. You know what I'm saying? Not too much going on. Not too much, you know? Not too much on me. Like yeah, so I'm gonna leave this here where it's at, y'all. Rate the look rate the beat and yeah 2024 is our year we're gonna get it together we're gonna do it like we're really gonna prosper this year and always know you are the prize baby always the prize do you hear me and yeah